We have come yet again to the end of another eventful week here in the land of the brave. We've laughed, we've cried, we've edited out parts of the show where I cried. So let's look back fondly at the best moment from this week's The Late Show. There have been more developments in the scandal surrounding Alabama Senate candidate and man demonstrating how tall you must be to date him. <laughs> Roy Moore. Not everybody wants more anymore, which is why some Republicans are floating the idea of delaying the December 12th special election in order to get Moore's name off the ballot. Wait, you can just do that? <laughs> you can just move an election where you want if that's the case. Can we move the next presidential up to tonight? Yeah! <laughs> yeah, we got time. Moore, to defend himself, <laughs> He went on the Hannity radio, right, to strongly make things much worse. I don't remember ever dating any girl without the permission of her mother. <laughs> what, wait, I, wait, how did you just make this creepier? <laughs> permission from her mother? Hands She's a 14-year-old girl, not a field trip. And out. The rest of development, uh, an incredible show that... Uh, sort of was prescient about the Trump. You know, it's, Sadly, it's, yes. it, was, it was Trumping before anybody else, because it's about yeah. this... Except we got an Emmy. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Hey! President Trump is finally back from his 12-day trip to Asia. And according to him, the trip was a huge success, bragging to reporters, a lot of people said it's almost physically impossible <laughs> for someone to go through 12 days. <laughs> <laughs> really? You know, there are people who live in Asia forever, right? We're talking about like this was a wave election, and somehow... Only he is. <laughs> Only he's talking that, like that. No, that, that. Nobody said I could no. win. Nobody said. <laughs> well, Biggest electoral victory of all time. Uh, yeah, that, of all time, uh, Joe. Uh, yeah. Of all time. <laughs> I'm sorry, your lady lost, but the biggest of all time. Jeff Sessions' testimony to the House Judiciary Committee covered a wide range of issues, and Sessions had the same answer for a lot of them. I don't recall. I don't recall. I don't recall. I don't recall it. I do not recall. I don't recall it. I didn't recall it, but I had not recall. <laughs> not a great memory. Uh, in fact, just to remember those answers, he had to write them on his hand. <laughs> Do uh, white audiences and black audiences get frightened by this movie in the same way? Do they experience the horror in the same way? It, uh, no. Okay. I don't think so. I think that's... Imp yeah. I mean, I think black people, you know, it's like the second the, the, the movie comes up and, like, the, the protagonist is dating a white girl, they go, oh, he's in trouble. <laughs> mm, I don't like where this is going. <laughs> He's in an interracial relationship. Uh -huh. Get out, brother. Uh -huh. Um, uh -huh. And white audiences go, that's very progressive. <laughs> yeah, that's very progressive. That's cool.